Hey there, Scorpios, and welcome now to Friday. Well, it looks like another day of storms for the Scorpios, likely of maybe even temper tantrums, and the reason being the moon is buried deep in your subconscious right now. All the other planets are on standby. There are a lot of squares, a lot of frustration. Things aren't moving the way anyone wants them to move at the current astrological moment, and adding fuel to all that fire, your emotions are really being tri triggered by deep karma. Karma meaning early childhood issues, past life issues, issues basically you haven't necessarily healed from, remaining self-sabotaging, or even sometimes it's just that uh, evil parent in our head that's still yelling at us that we continue. So emotionally, you're really doing a tour of things that need to be pulled up. It's the weeds in your garden, so to speak. And pay close attention in the next 24 hours, Scorpios, of what your heart is really saying, because the moon is trining Neptune, which is in the fifth house, the house of inner self, or the house of our inner child. So you really are in touch with your inner child in the next 24 hours. And the reason why I'm guessing storms is because the inner child probably not getting what it wants at this time, just looking at the stars of it. But either way, things do pick up probably Saturday night for you. So if you have a choice of going on a date tonight or tomorrow, pick tomorrow. The moon will actually go into Scorpio by late Saturday. What that does for you is really Bring your heart and your ego back online together. It really grounds you out, and it puts you into a sunny and cool icon for the rest of the weekend. So I'm guessing and predicting the first half of the weekend not so good. The second half much better for Scorpios, a lot more attuned. And do listen to your inner child. At the same time, which I think will create some disruption for the planet, is the sun will transition out of Cancer into Leo by Sunday. So no matter what and how good you're feeling in the moment, you'll probably notice, Scorpio, mark my words and write me, that the rest of the planet is really feeling funky on Sunday. That's because they're really experiencing the sun's transition, and they don't have the moon in their sign during it. So you're kind of lucky on this one. All right, Scorpio, that's all we got for the weekend forecast. See you back here on Monday. Live, love, be. So